If you haven't already, please click the subscribe button and turn those notifications on. And if you're feeling extra crazy, drop a like. So what's going on guys? Welcome back to the much anticipated 2019 boot collection video. You guys absolutely loved the last one I did and I did it like two years ago. So there's been a few additions. Uh, I am going to go through every single pair of boots. But ladies and gentlemen, I am going to be doing a giveaway, okay? And it's a pair of boots of your choice. Now Theo, how do you enter this giveaway? Okay, there's three things you got to do. You got to be subscribed with notifications turned on. The goal is to hit 850,000 by new year and I can't actually believe it, but we're, we're very, very close. Thank you so much for the support. Number two, you got to leave a comment with how many boots I have. So you have to watch the entire video and calculate and keep additions going in your in your head how many boots I have, okay? Um, I actually don't know myself, so hopefully you get the correct answer once I've gone through them also. And number three, you just gotta like the video, okay? There you go. Do all those three things and you can win a pair of boots of your own. And also, when you do leave a comment, can you just like leave your Instagram or Twitter so I can like, actually get in contact with you because it's very hard for YouTube. But either way, we're gonna crack on. Now, if you did see, Oh wait, hey, I don't know if you know this, but there's an here in the background. Anyway, if you did see the last one, um, I'm sorry, we're gonna go through them all, because a lot of people wouldn't have seen the last one. So, here we have it. We've got this section, um, yep. And we've got these sections. These are like the primo ones, or the latest ones. And we've got this lot over here, and little boy Porg down there. Remember, how many boots I show you is how many boots I have, okay? So, keep track, because you could win a pair of boots. So, in up, the first one is, oh! Some copers. There you go. Next up, we have some pure controls. Now, the pure controls were my favourite. Oh, I don't even know. I think I've only worn these like once or twice. Very, very nice. I didn't want to wear these because I felt like these were going to be quite rare, and I believe these are quite rare. But they're the um, they're like the, the the white camo pure controls. We have some X16 pure chaos coming up next. I wore these a lot. I believe I wore these in Austria as well in a video. So the pure chaos. Um, nice and green. All right. Oh, we have some more pure controls. Pure controls, as I said, were my favourite back in the day. Um, and these are the X, I think these are the 17 pluses, yeah, so they're 17 pluses. I do have the original 16, the first ever pure controls, which I'm going to show you later on in this video. And you might recognise them um, from a certain, certain football match. Don't know if I've got any memories of that football match. Uh, and the Nemesis up next. Um, as you can tell, these aren't going to be in order of date because it's impossible to order. Um, but we have some Nemesis, there you go. Very nice. Do you like them? Yeah. I quite like them. I actually really like Nemesis. Uh, the only problem was they give me a bit of a heel rub, so I didn't particularly wear loads of these, but as you can see, still got the label on. I'm very, very, very grateful how many boots I have, because obviously when I was a kid, I didn't have a lot of boots growing up. Um, so to have all of these now is unbelievable. And over the period of like the whole YouTube career, I've just been sent so many. So I just want to say shout out to Pro Direct Soccer, Sports Direct, Love All Soccer, um, New Balance, Adidas, Nike, Puma, everyone who has ever sent me boots. So thank you so much for, for fulfilling a lifelong dream. Right, next up we got these bad boys. Are uh, these are the Furont? Um, I got. I think these are the ones. Yeah, I got these when I was out in Russia for the World Cup, which was quite cool. These ones are very special, I believe. They're the CR7 Mercurial. I mean, look at that. As you can see, I did not want to take the label off these because I felt like these were going to be quite rare um also let me know in the comments guys which pair of boots out of my whole collection are your favorites and then we've got some more new balance now this is back in the day oh you know what yes these are the tequelas the new balance tequelas i wore these all the time these are actually one of my most worn boots i love the tequelas all right we're gonna go through a lot of bags now um we have the predators these i think these are these the original predators um I think these are the original Predators they remade, uh, which is quite nice to have actually. These ones are really nice, Luke, you're gonna love these. Um, these are the pure controls, um, but these are the laced version. So no, actually, I believe I have the um, like the other version of these as well somewhere. Uh, we've got some more Nemesis coming up. Um, these ones are the red Nemesis. Uh, I actually really, really like these. I think you'll look like a, a bowler when you're playing in these. You might get your legs hacked out though, so be careful when you're wearing these bright red Nemesis. These ones coming up, I wore loads because, as you can tell right now, <laughs> they used to be white, not so much anymore. They have had an absolute beating. Let's have a look at the left foot. Is the left foot going to be cleaner because I'm a right foot player? That's not, you know what? It's not bad for a, a right foot player. All right, these ones. Now, I believe, did I wear these for Wembley Cup? They have Wembley Cup written on them and they are studs, so I think I did. Yeah, look, Wembley Cup 2017. So that was the year I scored two. In um, and I wore these. Look, these these have only been worn once, and that was for the Wembley Cup. 
So this right here, Luke, that's the hallowed Wembley turf. Now, I believe I gave away a pair of these boots to the crowd or twice. Or I don't know if it was quite dangerous or not, but I, I literally chucked a pair of boots into the crowd to Adam had them. Had them. A nice lawsuit coming against you. <laughs> oh my god, I've just seen a pair of boots I had no idea even existed in the history of time. These Preds, what do you think of the colourway? Hmm. They're like a. Wait, are they meant to look dirty? Are they dirty? They're a little bit dirty, but they are, they are brown. Oh. Yeah. Anyway, look at these ones. Holy crud. Honestly. This is a this is a video from myself. Like I'm discovering boots I never had knew I had. Look at these bad boys. They are you are looking to get your legs taken out if you wear these. Bright luminescent red preds. Wow. Wembley Cup 2017. Oh, so I have two Wembley Cup 2017. So you got a pair of studs. These ones are metal studs, and I believe they changed into these at half time. So you look, these are the 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 alien peer control. Um, Oh, look inside there. Can you see the colours? See all the colours? Yeah. Quite cool, isn't it? Get down here now. Okay, we got. I'm going to try to speed through these. We've got more Furons. I think they're Furons. Here's some different colour. I think these are the second colourway of the Tekelas. The, the black and yellow ones. Very, very cool. As I said, I'm a big fan of Tekela. Very, very comfortable football boot. We've got ourselves an MLS football. Furons coming up. Uh, similar colourway to the last Tekela I showed you. Lovely little Furon. Right, I believe... Oh, another pair of Furons. All right, I think I wore these a lot. Yeah, look at these bad boys. Lovely bit of pure chaos again. Pure controls. They change from like pure chaos, pure control, whatever. These, this actual pair of boot, okay. Forget the colorway. This pair of boot with like this. I think it's these. I think these are the 16 pure controls, or maybe the 17. Or were my favourite pair of boot ever. And you'll see throughout this video, I got a lot of them, and a lot of them are also heavily worn. Oh wow. The messy boots. Messy. Wore these. Well, like those are that. No, you don't actually. Oh. <laughs> these are the messy boots. Um, uh, these were part of a giveaway, so I gave away a pair of these uh, in the past as well. More pure controls coming right up, Luke Martin. This time, the storm version. Actually, I don't actually know what they're called. These are the 17 plus pure controls. Anyway, I wasn't a big fan of the 17 plus pure controls when they turned into the Preds. I was like, yes, that's a bit of me, and I actually preferred the 16 plus pure controls over the. Um, Pred. I just realised I've been calling. Yeah, I've just realised I've been calling some pure chaos, pure control. Either way, you know what I'm talking about. Maybe I'll get some facts on during this video. But anyway, we've got some more Nemesis. More. This was the same pack. So this is the same pack as the other one. So like the Stormy pack. Here we have some more Nemesis. 17 plus 360 agility in the tiger colour. No, I want them. You want these? Yeah. Well, we have to sort you a little deal, Luke. All right, here coming up, we've got some more. Pure controls, the big boy greenos, um, never been worn before because I don't want to get these dirty because I don't know why but I'm sort of, I'm banking on all this boot collection coming in handy one day, you know when I've failed YouTube. Right, more pure controls, here we go, what colour are these bad? Oh, bloody hell, look at them! This is a bit of you, Luke. This is a bit of you. I like the bright colours. You like? The, I like the bright colours as well, to be fair. They are very nice. Wowzers. As I said, this is like a bit of like a, a fun video for me to make because obviously I moved out like a year and a half ago and I haven't been back and seen my actual collection in a very long time. So I'm quite enjoying this. Now this is the original Predator box. I don't think the boots are in here because I've already shown them. Yeah, I have already shown them to you. But this is how the first ever remake of the Predator came. Um, I thought that was quite cool. Coming right up, Luke. We've got some more. Look at that. Surely oh this God. is so rare. That's like a Call of Duty camo. Yeah, do you not think? Surely this pure... Chaos is so rare. Like me not wearing some of these boots surely has benefited me in the long run. Like, have you ever seen this pair of boots ever? But that boot could make you the best football player in the world. It could, and I never worn it, and I'll never know. I never would have known what my potential could have been. You're absolutely right there, Luke. Right, empty box. I swear we've seen these before. You've got quite a lot of them, but they're well nice as I well. Do. I like the Furons a lot. Oh, I've got quite a few pairs. Shiny, these. like. The gloss is really nice, isn't it? But obviously, over time, it, it wears. As soon as you play one game in the in the in the Furons, or any boot that has that shine at the bottom, they go straight away. These ones coming up, mate. These are very very nice because I, these are very rare. I think like, don't quote me on these, but how many of these were made? I don't know. Like, I'm pretty sure like 25 of these were made, which is nuts. They're a Paul Smith collaboration with New Balance. I'm gonna say like 25 of these were made. So these might actually be some of my rarest boots. Mm -hmm. 
No, it doesn't. So very, like maybe even a hundred. I don't know. Either way, super, super rare football boot. What we got here? More Tekelas. Uh, you know what? I'll go as far as say that's my favourite colourway, the Tekelas. I'm a big fan of blue. So back in the day, I had to keep buying all these boxes from the range because in my head, I was like, yeah, I'm going to put them all in boxes. But then as you can see, um, I sort of gave up with that. But anyway, let's go through the boxes. So we've got these bad boys. I believe Kieran Brown ranked these as like the number one boot of the decade. For me, they rubbed. Um, I wasn't a big fan of these Nike ones. Um, and I once, wore these, I once wore this pair in a game for hashtag. And I, I have to admit, it was the worst game I've ever played in my life. I couldn't kick a ball, so I never really wore these again. Even though they look really, really cool, I never wore them again. Now we have some more, these are like the old school New Balance. Um, this pair of boots, a very, very limited edition Bizarro pair of boots, loved them. For some reason, they just caused me to score in the top corner every single time. And then this pair of boots, I bet, I, I don't know if I'm wrong or right here, but I believe these change, change when they get wet. I think they change color when they get wet. I believe Jimmy, Conrad had these pair of boots and he proved they change colour when they get wet, which is really, really cool. Okay, these are, these are, these, as I said with the last New Balance ones, which are super rare, these are so incredibly rare. These are Aaron Ramsey's own New Balance boots. So a hundred of these were made, as you can see, pair 73. Only 100 of these were made, pair 73. Um, and they're Aaron Ramsey's custom from his like tattoos, so all of this is all, all on his tattoos, and they're a size, and they're only made in I think like a size seven and a half, because that's what a uh, size football boot is. Yeah, seven and a half. Only a hundred of these were made, and all in the seven half, because they're Aunt Ramsey's football boots. And at the bottom, we have got oh again, New Balance. These ones are super super rare. They're like, all leather, like very English pair of football boots. I think, I think like a thousand of these were made. Very very cool. I wish I had the original box because it came with like leather cleaning equipment um, and then these ones oh they're not football boots but they are boxing shoes and wore them in the fight against joe all right we got not a pair of boots but we've got a pair of shoes air force ones size 49 and a half they're absolutely massive the fa gave me these um as part of when i like worked a lot of the fa it was really really cool but there's whiz through these bottom ones because a lot of them are just the new balance furons new balance Vizaros. this is actually a very cool new balance furon because if you feel that it's like a can you feel it? it's not like a normal football boot feel? It's like I a, can hear it. Yeah, it's like a carpet. Like fabric. Yeah, yeah. we're really going into that New Balance stage now. Um, again, with the fabric feel. Quite a cool design. Uh, there you go, the two little ones here. Coming up, some more Furons. Again, I love the fan of the blue and the Vizarro. Furon, Vizarro, Vizarro, Furon. Even if I said that completely wrong way around. But either way, we move on. Coming up are a pair of boots that were one of my favourites, but unfortunately, I got them like that half size too big. I was gonna make a whole Steven Gerrard recreation video um, and I didn't because they were just slightly too big, but how nice are these? These are the original remade Pure Controls and they released them in like that original Predator color. Now let's get a close up on these bad boys. And something crazy about these, not that they, they stopped doing it because they realized it was a bad idea, but they put Ultra Boost in a football boot. Can you see that? That's Ultra Boost right there. You know like Ultra Boost technology? They put it in a football boot. Don't ask me why. Um, but it wasn't the best idea. <laughs> right, let me move on. Surprise, surprise, some more. Oh, well. Okay, so this oh, is, really? these are Astros. These are New Balance Astros. And then these are my, this is my bag jaw. <laughs> All right, we've got some more Astros. These, okay, wait, let me just clarify, okay? Astros do not count towards the boot collection. So you've got to really use your mind with obviously working out how many we got, okay? So obviously the Air Force Ones don't count towards, the boxing shoes don't count towards, these Astros don't count towards, these Astros do not count towards, even though they're nice and pink, the Astros do not count towards the boot collection total. So make sure you remember that and get the answer right to win a pair of footballs for yourself. But as usual, move on to my one of my favorites. Um, these are, do you remember I showed you the Pure Control? This is the Pure Chaos version, um, as you can see. Very heavily worn. Again with these uh, original Bizarros. I think this was actually the original Bizarro. I think this was the first one I ever got sent. Wore these a lot, absolutely loved them. Oh! They're a spider. Oh, it's a dead spider. Oh, no, can you see that? Anyways, we got some, um, what are these ones, Vizarro's? Yeah, these are Vizarro's. Is that nice? Vizarro, Vizarro. Very, very nice. These were included in my first ever uh, boot collection back in the day. I don't know if you remember them. Okay, we got the Evo Speeds and we got the Evo Powers. I wore these and I got these when I filmed with, do you remember, like, Christian Fuchs, um, 
Giroud check that day. I think you came along to that, not the Fuchs one. Fuchs wasn't there. You yeah, came I, to the came check to one, yeah. Check. Very cool, so I wore these with them bad boys. Furon. 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 Okay, so next up we've got two of my favourite ever pairs of boots. One of them, well, one of them, I'm the only one who has these pair of boots. No one else in the world has these pair of boots. And the other one, very, very rare. So we've got the Addy Zeros F50. These are probably the oldest pair of boots I own, barring a pair of boots which like, are unusable. So these are the oldest pair of boots I can actually wear. Um, all blacked out, Addy Zero F50s. I don't know if you can see them, they're all full leather. Some of my favorite pair of boots, incredibly light, full leather, so they're an unbelievable pair of boots. Um, and also, I don't know if you can see, do you remember when Adidas had like that My Coach or My My Coach, something like that? You could put a little uh, tracker in it, it would track your speed and everything. Uh, so these, an unreal pair of boots. And then, as I said, this pair of boots coming up, only one person has them in the world, and that is me, because I customised them. I paid for these like five Christmases ago. Black and gold, they got Theo written on them. They're my favourite X15s. Um, absolutely love them. Look, black and gold, Adidas, they've been worn a lot. I wore them at uni loads and changeable studs. Only I have them in the world because Adidas customization. Okay, before we move on to like the newer pairs of boots, which is this pile, we are gonna go through uh, this tower of boots. Try and do it quickly. For you, <laughs> what was that? We got another tower of boots before we move on to the new ones, okay? So at the bottom, starting us off, we have blackout, um, what are these? <laughs> I actually don't know what these are called. I would have no idea. They're, Kevin De Bruyne wore them. So, there you go. Uh, and then we actually have, flipping out, how nice are they? <laughs> Pure blackout. This is part of the blackout collection, as you can see, they came in together. Um, these are the Mercurial Vapors. Um, Vapors? <laughs> these are the Mercurial Vapors, I believe, or the Phantoms. Oh, I don't know, I'm so bad at football books. They're blackout, they look really, really nice. On to the next ones. All right, here we have the Blackout Tiempos, which completes the collection. Uh, all leather, kangaroo premium leather. There you go, blackout tempos, followed by black and orange tempos. Some of my favorite pair of boots I own. I absolutely love these black and orange tempos. Next up, we got more tempos. Not a fan of the colorway, like it nonetheless. And then these ones, the champagne pack copers. They're so nice. Yeah, you, you're eyeing these up so hard, aren't I'm you? I'm gonna steal them these, so like, well. These are some of my favorite pair of boots. I know I've said that a lot, a lot but I cannot tell you how nice they are. You know me, the champagne collection, very, very rare. I've got another pair of boots as well I got on them. I got two pairs from the champagne collection. I've bought them myself. Next up, we got the original Nemesis, the black and white. I made a whole football boot video on these. I said, do these make me faster? The overall result was, they make you faster. All right, here we have some Umbros. The only pair of Umbro boots I own, and uh, hashtag gave them to me for joining. Then we got these, uh, I believe these are the Furons. Oh, I'm so bad at knowledge. Uh, I think these are the Furons. I wore them a lot because Blackout New Balance, um, they're just really nice. And these ones are quite rare as well. Almost at the top of the tower, Luke. We're getting through this pretty fast now. Here we have some Pure Controls. Blackout Pure Controls, followed by Black and White and Luminescent Green Pure Controls. Which do you favorite out of these two? Mine? Yeah. Okay, Flynn. Next up, one of the most Precious pairs of boots that I own. And you know for a fact that I'm gonna be playing the clip once more. At the top, we have the original Pure Controls. Okay, first ever Pure Control they made. First ever Adidas laceless boot. And do you wanna know the last time these are worn, Luke? As you can see, wait, wait, wait. As you can see, there's a lot of mud all over them, isn't there? When was the last time these are worn? Well, Dad, I've gotta say, you've tried to chip Peter Michael three times. Don't try it again. It seemed like he was going for a cross from that one, but I would like to have seen him just have a blast of the noise. Good shot. Oh, I like this. It is to your big oh, oh, It's going through the lot of them. Oh! So yeah, these were the boots I scored that infamous goal and played in a Wembley Cup game. Uh, so these are probably my favourite pair that means the most to me. Does that make sense? Like these are my favourite pair of boots I own because they mean the most to me. So They have sentimental value. They have value. sentimental value, exactly. So they have their own specific draw right at the top where they belong. And then up here, what we got? We got some more Nemesis. This time in that orangey tiger colour. And then we got some X16 Pure Chaos. Oh, these ones I won. I won these at a Pro Direct event. I won like high score or something. So these are the like very rare, very, very rare 
black and purple pure chaos and as you can see or oh, pure control rather so they're in a pure chaos box i don't know why but these are the ones that hang on my wall this looks like a special pair of boots doesn't it it's got its own box <laughs> what like all the others yeah but it's own like different design look you can even see look luke limited collection which means they're very very important can you see that limited collection what is that collection you may ask well do you remember the champions league in Cardiff, in Wales, I had expected a pair of boots for the Champions League final, and uh, they're like the Welsh Champions League pure controls. They did make the pure chaos as well, but I just got the pure controls. They got like Welsh design, they got dragon all over them. Um, I think they're very, very cool. So before we move on to like the final big ones, oh, we got two pairs down here. Um, these ones are, like, I think, probably my most worn pair of boots I own. As you can remember, I did so many videos in these. Um, they're the most comfortable. They smell the most. Uh, oh god, they smell vile. Oh, well, I've just played them in so many games, so they mean a lot to me. And then in these ones, I think these are just. Oh wow. Yeah, these ones I'm wearing at the moment. So these ones are the Blackout um, Pure Speed. Are they called now? They called Pure Speed, something like that. Blackout. I wear these the most. As you can see, a bit of Hawaii dirt on them. Now before we open these bad boys, the final ones, we need to head around the house. So I believe there's a few scattered in the house and in the car. All right, found three pairs of boots in the porch. We've got these bad boys, the pure chaos. You remember me wearing these in videos? Love these, one of my favorite pairs of boots. I love the black and pink. Uh, these ones, total nighted. Wow. Probably, you know what? These are probably some of the most expensive boots here that they are so dirty and they actually have a spider on them. Um, these are some of the oldest I own. Actually, yeah, these are definitely the oldest I own. Um, and then, oh, I don't even want to touch these. Can you understand? Like, these are ancient. Like, Luke, get, in, get a shot in there. They're full of spiders, spiders' eggs, spiders' nests. These are, I mean, they're technically part of the collection, but they're going to take about four years of, um, oh, four years. Decontamination. Yeah, decontamination. I'm going to put those back there and head to the car. Now, I'm not going to be including um, any of the boots that I've given away, because I've given a lot of boots to my friends, um, my family, and also just giveaways, so they're all long gone now. But I believe I've got a couple in the boot. Um, there you go, got a tennis racket. And then we got some preds. These preds, very, very nice preds. I think you'll like these, look at them. I feel like I've worn them before. You have worn these, these are the ones I always lend you actually whenever you play footy. Speaking of preds, got these ones who I lend my friend Dan all the time. He's gonna be wearing them to their annual Christmas football match. Very nice, all blue. And then to finish off the boot collection, get it? Boot, in the, oh. in the boot, yeah, you get it. Uh, we got a pair of pink Nemesis. <laughs> Which are very nice. I wore these when I went to that original, when I started off doing the uh, football pitch videos, remember? I went to the one in Eastbourne. Now before we carry on, two boots that have to be included are um, two boots I've accidentally left in London annoyingly. So one of them is the Champagne X's. You've seen them, I wear them in videos all the time. Absolutely love these. I'm just showing that my old boot collection videos so you can see them. And then the other pair of boots that I left in London, which uh, you must include to be able to win a pair of boots of your choice, so include them in the count, are these golden X's. As you can see, I'm pulling them out of the box here in the previous video. They're golden, they're X's, they're my favourite, and look how nice they are. Aren't they just sublime? Some of my favourites, actually. Annoyingly, I left them in London because they are some of my favourites, and I wish I could have shown them again. And real quick, you've got to include these ones. Um, I, I've actually lost these, but they count as my collection because I know they're in the house somewhere, I just can't find them. They're my original X's, um, some of the first boots I ever got, so definitely include these. I'm definitely not getting concerned or anything, but this is the fourth pair of boots I'm quickly adding in now. And um, you guys should remember these from a time ago if you've been watching me for a long time. But they're the, um, the these ones. They're the pure controls, all gold. So um, I'm not scared. I don't know where they are, but they count towards the collection. All right, now to finish it off, we got one, two, three, four, five, six pairs of boots to finish it off. So let's do it. All right, first up from Nike. We got some Tiempos, which you would have seen in my Ronaldinho boot video, which you'll see them later on in the video. But these are some Tiempos Nike sent me earlier this year. Next up, we have a pair of boots, which in the last boot collection video, I said, these are my favorite pair of boots ever. They're not my favorite pair of boots ever, but they mean a lot to me because I wore them as a kid. And I finally saw them on a website. I was like, I have to get these. They're like 60 pound, absolute bargain. The Reebok. Evo Rage, something like that. Look at these bad boys. I wore them as a kid. They're, they've got like super soft fabric inside. So very, very comfortable and I had to pick them up. For only 60 quid, that's a pure memory. Roman, you don't like these at all. No, I used to have them when I was did a kid. Did you actually? Yeah, yeah, So did, so did uh, Harry Rotashaw. Everyone, everyone wore these as a kid. Yeah, they, they were classic. Told you. Right, we got some more Nike 
boy there. Oh, yeah. How nice are these? Phantoms, Nike Phantoms. I mean, yeah, I'm never wearing these. Make sure the bottom, it looks sick. Look at that, I am never gonna wear these. Do you know why? Because they get ruined. And do you really want to ruin these? It's like they're white and gold and just incredible. Anyways, we've got some more Nike ones coming up this time. Black and gold, not the white and gold. Some more Phantoms, but without the top bit. Um, again, really, really nice, just black and gold. I do prefer white and gold, but black and gold's a bit more like subtle flex. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> subtle flex? Yeah. Is that what you're doing when you're wearing boots? You're, you're flexing your skills, because remember, the fancier boot you wear, the better you are at football. Oh yeah, no, I've heard that. I've yeah, heard fact. That. Right, now the last two pairs of boots, Luke, all right? Wow. Two of the most expensive and two of the most memorable pairs of boots. Expensive? Have you bought these boots? I bought both of these pairs of boots. Wait, so you're going to reveal... So, these Ronaldinho ones are about 360 quid, which I bought my own money. Um, you would have seen them, I released them on a video very, very soon, uh, very recently rather. Only 1,000 of these made in the world. The original R10s. Um, uh, these are pair 903. So, as you can see, um, I wore them in a video and the chrome, some of the chrome has come off, which is a bit upsetting. Um, so they're not in mint condition anymore, unfortunately. But, it's definitely one of the pair, best pairs I own. Ronaldinho's own R10s, they're just, do you like them? Do you like them? I do. And they're they're like tempos, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, 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 like the R10 tempos. And I can say, these are the most comfortable boots I've ever worn in my entire life. And these ones, oh, you know earlier when you were talking about David Beckham? Yeah. How much? I can't remember, I'd say like 350, 400 I think. Um, but yeah, here we go. So these are the Predators. These are the David Beckham Preds. Like, as you can see, DB in there. It says DB in there. Uh, DB on the back. They made a Zidane version, like gold accelerators. I think it's accelerators. Anyways, these are the Preds. Um, they come with red laces. It's just like, <sighs> you don't, get much more classic than these, do you? Ever worn them? Yep. Good. Worn for a video, and then that's it. I don't know, some people collect stamps, some people collect shirts, I collect football boots, that's my thing, all right? Which is, I think it's a fair enough. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comments how many I've shown you, and whoever gets it right, I'll pick someone to, I'll buy them a pair of boots, whatever they want. Whatever they want, I'll buy them for them. And uh, make sure you do leave your Instagram and Twitter, because otherwise it's just really hard to find you get in contact with you but yeah if you have enjoyed the collection please drop it a like i've absolutely ruined it look show look back up back up this is the whole place is like an absolute tip now luke isn't it like anyways uh, if you have enjoyed the video please drop a like subscribe if you haven't already and from me and little little porgy i'll see you very soon